What's going on people? We are Tottenham TV here. A bit of a different video for you today. We've got the demo of FIFA 20 that was released yesterday. So we've got this for you. Tottenham Hotspur are on the demo and we're going to have a look through the player ratings and see what we have. Obviously, exactly. We, we need to know how good a Tottenham in FIFA 20. We exactly. need to know how good a Tottenham in real life because obviously FIFA runs all and tells you all what you need to know about exactly. how good a player Only is. Only Champions League teams are in the Yeah, sorry, the Arsenal demo. don't seem to be here. Oh, no, we 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 playing Chelsea. Oh, look at those new kits. Beautiful. Go, go back, go back. Let's see the third kit. It looks so good. Oh, I love all three of our let's kits. Let's play in the third kit. All three of our kits are beautiful. All right, let's start off. All right, let's go in. Let's start off with the keeper, as always. Hugo Lloris, well, he's 88, which is exactly the same as he was given last year. No difference for that. And, you know, look, this is a keeper a lot of people criticise. He's 88 on FIFA. That's a decent rate. The same as Edison. Yeah, that, I think it's fair as well. When you look at the actual stats, diving 89, handling 82, kicking 68, probably fair. Yeah. Uh, reflex is 91 now. Now, that, that's fair. his forte, isn't it? It's actually gone down from last year, 92 last Why? season. Why? Why has it gone down? I don't understand. With all his penalties saved last season, I definitely should have gone up. Speed, 64. Surely he's got he's faster than 64. I thought he's quite fast for a keeper. Yeah, for a keeper. I don't know how they judge these things. Mm. Weak foot, one star. <laughs> That's so accurate. <laughs> if you give him half a star, I think I'm going to be more accurate. And positioning, 84. Look, yeah, Hugo's a great keeper. He's gone out. His positioning's gone up. His speed's gone down. He's, I don't know why his reflexes, reflexes has gone I think down. His reflexes are unbelievable. I think they're one of the, he's one of the best keepers in world football with his reflexes. But 91 is a high rating, but to go down. Aurier, he's 79. 79, yeah. To be fair, I don't think he should have gone down from last year. I think every time he was called upon last year, he did a good job. He's gone down two, two points. Mm. He's gone down from 81 to 79. Let's look. Phys physical, he should maybe be a bit higher than 76. He's pretty physical. Physical's gone down from 79. Pace, 77. What was that on last year? 78 last season. He's slower, apparently. Yeah, he's got a yard slower, has he? Um, I don't know. It we'll, remains to be seen how he gets on. Obviously. Yeah, look, look. These, these are obviously subject to change with FIFA changing their ratings pretty much on a weekly basis. Yeah. So I think, look, he's starting off with a 79. Right, let's move on to Toby. Big move for Toby. He was at 85 last season, gone two points up to an 87. But obviously, yeah, he went from not playing a lot that, to the back end of that season and then he was ever present last year, wasn't he? Exactly. So I think his injury record probably uh, improves him a lot. He's actually he's actually gone down, gone up one physically, defending 88 from last season, saying his pace has gone up by two. He's got faster, Shooting has he? gone up by two. No, his, well, shooting's his, gone down by two. Well, he hasn't scored, has he? He scored against Scotland. <laughs> <laughs> and his passing should be about 80, 80 his something. The same. His passing is the same. His, his passing should two. be 80 something. You know, all those pings he does, cross field balls. I agree with you. I don't know why. Why is his passing so low? Why don't they raise passing? This guy's the best passing for a centre back, maybe, maybe apart from Van Dyke in the league. Yep. 100%. All right, move on to Jan. Same as last season, 87. I think he carried on his consistent performances. I think pace is fair, shooting is probably fair, passing is fair, dribbling. Now nah, his dribbling has got to be. And also, did they not see him at Dortmund at home last 100%, year? Hundred percent. His dribbling was it on this? Seventy two. Yeah, seventy two on here. But how is his defending gone down? One. He's gone. The defending's gone down from eighty eight to eighty seven. FIFA, what are you doing, mate? Come on. I think Davinson and Dyer were right to be angry at FIFA. 100%. What are they, what are they playing at? at Physical, least... His physicality has got to be bigger than 79. Same as and his dribbling there. has to be more than 72. I think his dribbling should be like 78. I like literally near the, the low end. He's a great dribbler for a centre-back. Mm -hmm. All right, right, move yeah. on to Rose. Danny Rose. Danny. Danny Rose. His pace must have gone down, surely. 80. What was he like? Yes. He was 80 last season. It's 77. Right? No, he's gone up one in pace. Oh, it was 78 last year. Yeah. Well, I, I feel he's lost a yard, never mind game. <laughs> no, 76 last year, he's gone up to 77. Interesting. Shooting? Shooting last season, 62. Same. Yeah. Passing? 73. He's gone up one. Well, it should have gone down, I think. Dribbling, dribbling's gone up two. Okay. And defending's gone up two, wow. And physical? Gone down, his physical's gone down one. Thing that's fair? No, I think he's quite physical. I think his physical should have gone up and his passing should have gone down. 
Um, is it, well, he kept the same score, 80. Yeah. All right, go, go uh, Ndombele. Ndombele, I don't have his last year's score. He's not the positive his first score. Yeah, year. but for him to be an 81 and Winks to be an 80, I think it's a joke. Why? Are you, I think he's got to be at least 82, 83. And Maybe Dombele. even more, 84. Surely on par with someone like Deli Ali. You know? Well, he's still here. Yeah. Come on, man. Ndombele, 81. He's got, I'm expecting more than that. I think maybe, maybe we're he's thinking because he's our... He's shooting 65. Did they not see his belter against <laughs> Aston Villa? Passing 78, dribbling 87. FIFA were watching when he battle he dominated Man City. Surely he's got to be more physical than 78. Yeah, 78. I bet you by the end, by uh, a few games in, you watch, he'll be up. He'll be up. All these stats will be up. Go to Winks. Harry Winks. <laughs> oh, nice, lovely. Harry Winks. He's an 80. He's gone up five points. Big <laughs> mover. Harry Winks, my guy. Come on. Come on, Harry. Yeah, he's gone from the, from the mid-70s to the 80s. That's nice. Exactly. Uh, passing, international. passing 77. Dribbling 83. Surely his passing's got to be better. Than dribbling his. has got up nine points. Surely his passing's got to be better than his dribbling. Interesting. With FIFA C, his dribbling is his main, main, uh, main strong point in his game. Mm-hmm. But if, yeah, we all Spurs fans would say, say his passing for sure. And I'll definitely say his physicals in the 70s. Passing's been up to physical. Well, is he that physical? I mean, he's a small guy, but he gets about. Yeah, I guess. He's not that strong, is he? He's fairly no. strong for his size. Defending has gone up a lot from 64 to 71. Yeah. Physical has gone up three points. And shooting is fair Shooting is the same. Shooting is the same. Shooting is a bit faster. Harry Winks can actually play in this FIFA, thank God. <laughs> Finally, he's going to be in the Go, go to Del Boy. Deli Alley. What was he last year? 80, 84 this year. He was 84 last season as well, so he hasn't moved. Yeah, it's fair enough to, for no moves. Uh, physical 79. That's decent, he's got only got up a point. See, I would say Winks is more physical than Alley. I think so, you think he's stronger than Alley? I think I think Alley's a bit more, he's taller, he's a bit broader, I think. My opinion. Dribbling 82. Yeah. Wait, what was Winks dribbling? 83. So wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> They're saying Winks is a better dribble than Deli Alley. Yeah. What? <laughs> FIFA? Are you serious? What, what? I don't his understand. Sh- and his shooting's got to be better than 85. He's got a mean shot. 81 game. shooting. 81 as well last season. He's gone up one passing. What do you think of his pace? 74. Dribbling. I oh, know dribbling is safe. Pace 74, Delhi. Yeah, I think that's fair. He's not particularly blistering. Is he? He's actually gone down one in pace. But actually, I think the big mover here, which is very perceptive of FIFA, defending has gone up six points, mm-hmm. which is definitely, I think, in line with how his game's progressed in that yeah. sense. Fair play. And his passing is 79. That passing should be 100. They'd not see his assist in the Amsterdam Arena in <laughs> the 95th <laughs> minute. Shocker. Come on, man. Passing. All right, Christian Eriksen. Wow. Christian Eriksen. 88. 88 last season as well. Where's his set pieces rating? That's what I want to see. He's, he's gone not, he's a down one notch on pace, but what a one up on shooting. 81 last season, 82. I think that should be 85 or something. What, shooting? shooting? Yeah, yeah definitely. He's a great long shot. Definitely. He's a lot better than Deli Ali in shooting. Yeah. I, don't, I don't understand. Uh, Dali, Deli's a better finisher than Ericsson, but Ericsson, like, he's more likely to get a shot on time mm-hmm. out of the box and stuff like that. I think he's got better technique, Ericsson. I don't know why he's shooting. Passing oh, 90. You... He's gone up one. It was 89 last season. And dribbling 90 this year. Down one from 86. What about his defending? That's the same as last season. And physical's down one. Mm-hmm. Weak foot five points. I think that's definitely accurate. And go to Human Son. Human Son is a big mover. Big mover after his great season last season. 84 last season. Wow. At 87 now. No, he, he fully deserves it. 100%. We've got a sick player now on FIFA, him and Son. Pace last year? 86. 88 this year. 86. He's gone up with two Shooting. points in base. 85 last season. He's gone up to 80. 100%. That's a very accurate. Like, uh, but Ericsson and Son, I guess Son probably is a bit better shooting than Ericsson. Um, not of not as much. I think. When, I don't know. I think I feel like when Son is on on either side of the box, he's just so clear. Yeah, because there yeah. is. So true. Really, yeah, he hits those corners every time, even if the keeper has to make a save. It's true. Those corners. It's true. His passing's 80. Yeah, he's gone up four. 
from okay. 76. His dribbling's got to be more than 87, surely. His dribbling was 85 last season. It's got to be above 90. He's one of the best dribblers in the league. Well, he, he, the thing with his dribbling, he's very direct, isn't he? He's not like a skillful dribbler. He's just mm-hmm. a very direct dribbler. Yeah. Which is, uh, which I think is fair. Defending 42, fair. Physical 68, fair. Same, both same from last season. I'm very happy with that. I'm going to be using him a lot more up front. Yeah, he's six foot. Yeah, wow, yeah, he is. He's, yeah, you actually don't underrate think him. He actually is. Yeah, and yeah, and they've put him as well. CF. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, they did he's that with Lucas Moura as well. Very interesting. Go to Harry. Harry Kane. He's gone up one point from last season. Eighty-nine last season. Hey, seventy. Shooting nineties. Uh, one up one. Shooting ninety-one. A bit mm. more clinical. <laughs> Even though he got less goals than he usually does last season. Surely Kane injury. should be like ninety-five. It should be hundred percent. If you let Kane shoot, he's a goal. If you, the only way you stop Kane is blocking the shot. Apart from the penalty. Yeah, yeah so. forget the penalty. <laughs> I mean, I was, oh, did you not see the keeper? He was about five yards yeah, off I his know, line. Joke. But at least he gets it out of the way for Costa. Yeah, really. it's true. Not for Spurs. He's scoring for Spurs. Passing's gone up one. Eight mm-hmm. from seventy-nine. Dribbling's the same. Defending 47, that's the same physical as the same. So he's gone up shooting and he's gone up dribbling. Uh, he's gone up uh, passing. Down, yeah, I think that's right. fair. Let's go to Lucas. Yeah, he's probably a big mover. 83. Last season he was 82. Right. So, so what's gone he gone up, up on? He's gone up, so pace is the same. Shooting has gone up five points. Damn right. I think that's. I think he really showed last season a different side to his game than what he's usually well, it's, showed. It's kind of like in patches, isn't it? I mean, no, he but... did so well in the Champions League, but did he score that many in the league? Well, I think he scored like 10 league goals, didn't he? 10? Yeah, league goals. I think he like, got 10 league goals. Really? Yeah, he got like 15 overall. I think he got 10 league goals. So, well, I mean, it was a hat trick against Huddersfield and two against United, so that's five in two games. Yeah. Um, that's what I'm saying, in patches. No, but I'm saying I think he showed a side to him where. In the, when he gets in the shooting position, he can be quite clinical. Mm-hmm. And I think it's reflected off. I think FIFA recognised he's actually quite a lot better than shooting than he can shoot. Than he. That guy's dribbling has got to be over 90. I'm sorry. It was 86 last season. Yeah, he's sorry, he's got to be over 90. He's one of the best. I said Son's one of the best dribblers in the league. He's better than Son. Yeah, yeah, 100%. He's, when he gets to this stride, he's absolutely unstoppable. He really is. The only thing that lets him down is he gets past up five players and screws up a chance. It's his end product sometimes. Exactly. But, but his dribbling is second to none. He's one mm-hmm. of the best in the league. I'd yeah. say easily top three. Yeah. I can't think of three better dribblers than him. Can you think of two? Can you think of one? Sadio Mane, maybe? you got Sane, Salah. Sterling. Sane, maybe. Uh, Salah. Salah. Salah Mane. Maybe that's four. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> Luke's the best. <laughs> Go to Musa. Who, Musa Sissoko, he must be a big mover from last season. Well, I think he was 79 last year, wasn't he? Last season, he was he was 76. Wow, 76. 76, he's got up five points, my guy, Musa Sissoko. That's who what needs, I'm talking who about. Who needs Bell when he goes Sissoko, right? Oh, man, I'm actually really happy for him. I think his Just pace has got to be more than that, first of all. Do you reckon players, look at that, look at their breaking going up, like five points would be like, Get in there like I'm having six. You saw Dyer and Sanchez. Yeah, I'm there, right? <laughs> <laughs> They're gutted. Like Sissoko was like, get in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. He was 76. No, but his pace has got to be more. He's much faster than that. Well, it's gone up from 74 to 80. Well, it should be 85 at least. I think 80. He's a powerful runner, but he's not exactly a quick runner. No, I think he is pretty quick, man. I don't know. I don't know if he's up there with like Son and Lucas and those uh, kind of players for pace. I think he is. I think, no, I think, I don't know. I, I don't think, he, I'm not saying he's slow. He's clearly a quick player, but he's not, like, rapid. He's just powerful, mm. you know? It's like Yaya Torre. You wouldn't say he's, like, Yeah, but I think quick. he's faster than Yaya. And for his you size, so? he's fast, man. Was he fast? Was he fast? I don't know. Maybe. But what else has he gone up? Shooting? If that's 70. gone up, if that's gone up, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what to say. His shooting should be in the 30s. His shooting last season was 72. It's gone down. Well done. No, well, his, his shooting should be in the third. <laughs> it's gone down. So fair enough. It should be go down a lot more. Passing 78, 74 last season. Dribbling 79. That should have gone up. Yeah. For sure. And the big mover. Oh, first of all, defending 64 last season. 64. And now it's 78. And physical. Physical last season, 84. And last Why season, was he 84. 84. He's, yeah, man, the guy's a beast. He's definitely deserved that. Mm-hmm. 100%. 
I think defending up 14 points. Yeah. 14. That's mad you moves. can see how many, how, how likely it is to be moving even one or two points. Yeah. 14. It's a mad move. 64 should never be 64. All right, go on to Lamels. Eric Lamella. What was he last season? 80 as well, so he's kept his rating. A75, shooting 27, passing 79, dribbling 82. Passing's gone down one. Dribbling stayed the same. Physical 72. Defending's gone up five. No, defending's gone up four points from 47. Physicality's gone up four. I think they're pretty fair ratings. For and other than, that, other than that, same thing, same yeah, thing. That's pretty fair ratings. For How could his week could be two stars? He never uses his one. <laughs> it should be minus a star. Literally. Um, Wanyama. Yeah. Who somehow stayed at the club? He's down two points, understandably. Is whoa, his pace has taken a big hit. His he's pace has gone from guy. 58 to 51. Bloody hell. He's, he's getting into like Mertesacker territory over there, mm-hmm. Lorente territory, 51 pace. <laughs> uh, <laughs> in the 30s, right? Yeah, probably. Well, he's getting to that stage. If he go, carries on at this rate, 65 so, shooting. 69 passing last season, 67 this season. It's gone down to passing. Uh, I think physicality is the big one. 88 physicality last season, it makes 82. Sense. It makes sense. FIFA's got that one spot on, I think. It's a shame. It's a shame. But hopefully we'll see him get back to his best this season, Victor. But I think FIFA's got this one. From what we've seen, they've got this one right. Uh, go to Davinson. Davinson, this is a bit disappointing. He was 84 last season. He's gone down to 83. See, 75. He's got to be... He's fast, Davinson. Yeah, he's a quick... He's gone down from 76. He's got to be 79. Yeah, 80. late 70s, I think. It's fair, early oh, 80s. early 80s, yeah. He's a quick defender. Um, Shooting 45. Passing 56, that's fair enough. <laughs> well, he wasn't happy about it. He's actually gone up one point. Yeah. But he wasn't happy about it, was he? Yeah. Said, he they asked him his pass. He goes, what, I think 80? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, whoa, Davinson. I don't know. I think you're rating yourself a bit high. But <laughs> bloody hell, 80 points. Um, I think or oh, fifty five and uh, fifty six. It's a bit harsh, but he's. I don't know. He's not on Toby's level. And yeah, he's, nah, he's different I think, level. I think that's fair enough for his passing. He's not a great passer. Dribbling has gone up one. Defending has gone down one, and physicality has gone down one. Mm. Yeah, he's always getting bullied, Sanchez. For a guy of his size, it's nuts. It's he now got, his third season. He this got is bullied big, by Joe Linton. I think this is a massive season for Dan. Yeah. Massive season for him. He's got a re- This is the season where he establishes himself as the successor to one of Jan and Toby, who are for one of the leads. And he's got to do a lot more if he wants to do 100%. that. 100%. I think if he if he doesn't step up this season, I don't know, you've got to worry that will we, will we, can, will we rely on him next season? He's got, he's got to cut these stupid mistakes out of his game because at the moment he's just making too many stupid errors. I believe he can do it. It's just he has he's, to. I've always said he's got all the tools to make a, one of the great centre backs, but he's just. He's too, too dopey and too weak on the ball at times. Yeah, I think there's a lot of concentration. He's just got to get that nailed down. I go to Bendy. Yeah, Ben Davis. He's gone down two points wow. from 81 to 79. And to be fair, he didn't have a great season last season, did he? Uh, compared to the season before, he was pretty good. So they're saying Ben Davis is only two slower than uh, Sanchez. Really? That's mad. Probably Sanchez is much faster. Yeah, than you think, well, yeah, you, I, I would say so. Davis passing has gone down one. Dribbling has gone down one. Defending has gone down one, and physicality has gone up one. Hmm. I think uh, we haven't seen a lot of him actually. But we, actually, if you think about Ben Davis since like last season, like since like around March. Time. We haven't yeah, seen injury him last like, year. Big yeah, and Rose was. kind of played the whole game last season. Yeah. We haven't seen him yet this season. I mean, he's kind of becoming a forgotten man, isn't he? Quickly. Yeah, he hasn't made one minute of appearance this season yet. Uh, we'll, we'll see what happens after the international break. You know, I think our fullback will be rotated a lot more. Um, let's Paolo. just go. Let's let's go through quickly the rest of them. paolo has gone up five points. I think that's fair enough. Yeah, that's Seventy fair enough. last season. Seventy-five. Foyth, he's gone up four points, 17 to 74. Uh, Carl Foyth should have a slash right back on him. Um, yeah, he will, he will, he will, of course. Um, Carl Capitas, I don't see him at all here, so that's probably a good thing. For him. <laughs> <laughs> um, Dyer is a good Eric one. Dyer, I think, is a big mover. 80. Well, he's only gone down one, but he's gone down. I think that's fair enough. He's as well. also becoming a football player. Yeah, again, he, he, he's. 
injuries. Scania get, and Skip must be a big move off. I don't see Skip here. But again, this is the beginning of last season, so I don't see I don't see him here. Skip and anyone else? Uh, I think down. that's I think those in Kudu. Uh, well, we don't have those cells, so when Tessie I'm on the squad, I oh, think yeah. it's only a demo. That's why. But we'll get and those ratings. Have Troy Paris, I believe I believe those cells so is 83, and I believe um, Ryan Sesson on is 75. And if you add those to the squad, that looks very healthy. You add an 83 there in the midfield, mm -hmm. and you add you know a bit of pace on the wing. Very healthy squad. All in all, do you think uh, EA's ratings are accurate? I think so. I think I'm very happy with this, uh, what they've done with Sissoko. Bring up to an 81, five extra points, and, uh, and Son as well. Son is big a big movers. one, isn't it? Yeah, two big moves, I think. With Son and Kane up front, and Ericsson just behind us, Dynamite. 88, 90, 87. Yeah, look at that. Front three. One of the, like, you think about that. Who who with higher rating? I know it's only FIFA, but who in higher ratings could Spurs actually get in this in, in, you know, in real life? Mm, not many. Who not many. who would be higher oh, rated? I wonder what Dybala is. Dybala's 88. 88. I think he was 89 last season. He's gone down to 88. But Dybala there instead of Son, that's realistic. Yeah, look at that. And then you got, yeah, bloody hell. you got Sissoko in there. Deli Alley. Great, great. Was, Lucas Moore has gone up to an 83. Yeah, Lucas is a big Moore. Yeah, <laughs> big Moore. Yeah, he's a big Moore. <laughs> big Moore. <laughs> That's a Moore. He's gone up to an 83. It's interesting they got him and Son as a CF mm -hmm. centre forwards, considering they played there a lot last season. Yeah, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, Toby's gone up two I think, yeah, Toby going up two points. I think it's perfectly reflected. Our weak points are in the full backs, as you can see, and every, um, then everything strong else Strong middle really strong. and strong, strong strike force. Yeah. So I think FIFA got this spot on. I would say I would say there's a few. There's, uh, a, little, there's a few iffy ones. San, like Sanchez's pace, there's a few other ones. Um, what was it? Deli Ali's passing. And Dombele and Wince only being one apart. Yeah, and Dombele's got to say at least two or three short. You'd say, but I reckon they'll be wrecked. I would say and Dombele's a clear five ahead of Wince. Five. Yeah. Five points. I don't know. I don't know if you can say that just yet. No. Oh. Well, it's very early. Yeah, we'll see. You know. We talk about Dombele rinsing it at Man City. We can't, remember, can't forget when went to the burner bar around the show. So, and, and at home against Barca. Exactly. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. All right. All right, so there you have it. That's the FIFA rating comparison to last year. Um, comment below what you think of the ratings. Do you think EA have been fair? Do you think they're right? Uh, like, subscribe, and comment. And as always, come on, you Spurs! Spurs.